YouTube, welcome back for a Harry Potter Geek Gear curated subscription box video. I'm Mr. Horcrux, joining me is my beautiful wife, Mrs. Horcrux. Together, we are the Horcrux Hunt. In today's video, we have a subscription box from Geek Geared Wizardry. This box is around $35 a month. We are super excited to share our sixth subscription box with you guys. But before we get into it, let me hit you with the intro. Welcome back and thank you to everyone who showed us love and support on our last video. If you like what you've seen, hit that like button and let's see if we could get up to 100 likes on this video. If you are new here, hit the subscribe button and hit that notification bell to keep up with the latest from the Horcrux Hunt. With that being said, let's make some magic. So you guys, Geek Gear is a monthly subscription box bringing wizarding magic to your home. They have up to six to 10 exclusive products from the wizarding world, exclusive licensed products you won't find anywhere else. That includes Harry Potter and Fantastic Beast merchandise. With that being said, here we go. All right, you guys, you know what it is. This is the Geek Gear Wizardry Box, and it is handmade with love. And just like a mystery box, we're gonna let you guys take a peek. I'm gonna look away for a second, and boom, there's your peek. I'm gonna move it to my, ooh, my right side. Dibs. And let's see what the first item in this box is there's usually seven six with the charm seven Dibs. did you, you already know what this is well i kind of looked while wow. like... oh Ooh. oh wow this is the saint mungo's hospital Milady's injuries diagon alley mm -hmm. this is the Hospital well, that Harry Potter was born? <laughs> oh. No, it's just a, a wizard's hospital. Oh, okay. That's cool. Oh, it's the hospital that um, Gilderoy Lockhart went to. Ah. Oh. When did he go there? After he cast the Ruby Eight spell on himself. Oh, okay. That is pretty cool. And you got the dibs on this one. Oh, for now. <laughs> that was the first item in the box. The hospital that Lockhart went to after oblivion himself. That he's known for doing to a lot of people. Second item in the box is... Ooh, what's this? Ooh, chocolate frog. 70% Honeyduke's chocolate frog. 70% finest. Croco. 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 It's like cocoa. Ooh. But the frog says cloak. Oh, I am so late to these jokes, guys. I am very <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm having a moment. Warning choking hazard, not suitable for uh, children under three, so I probably will choke on this thing. Oh my god. What is it? Oh, it's just a, it's a replica. A I think it's edible. Uh, hold on, guys. Take a smell. Mm, that's not edible. So this is definitely a 70% finest croca. That's the joke. That's mm, the frog. That's cute. It's not edible, guys. It's not edible, guys. Do not eat this, children under three. Or above. Because I almost took a uh, bite out of it. It looks really good. I like the box. box is pretty fancy. Mm-hmm. So very cool. We could use these in a lot of our photos. Yes. Oh, do you want in the no. okay. That's the second item in the box. All right, let's dig deeper, guys. Let's see what else they have in here. All right, third item in the box. Boom! Oh. Ooh! This is uh, the Gryffindor sword. Looks like it. Sword of Gryffindor. Okay, children Cheers. number three. You're not allowed to play with this. Oh, 
Uh, yeah. Wow, dibs. the letter opener dibs. I already said it. Wow. Wow, that's a beauty. Okay, I don't know if anything could beat that. Now we could open our letters with style. That's so cool. Or we can unbox things with style. Mm, I don't know. You're gonna mess it up. I'm definitely going to mess it up because it looks very broad. But wouldn't it be cool to unbox stuff with this thing? It would. Cool. Okay, dibs. This is my favorite thing in the item. Since you are a Gryffindor and I'm a Slytherin, yes, this is my... dibs on you, ma'am. Ma'am, sir. That's your ma'am, sir. Thank you. Okay, that is cool. Cool thing in the box. My favorite, your favorite. Whatever. Oh. Uh, one, two, three, fourth item in the box. What's that? This looks like a flute. Who plays the flute, guys? So, I don't know what that means. <laughs> yep. If you know what language that is, put it in the comments down below. Oh, wow. That's wow. Pretty cool. What the? Okay, this is like real wood. Feel that? This is Hagrid's? What is this? Hold wow, on. Wow, that's nice. Pause. Give me a sec to recollect on who and what played that. That looked like it's really carved. Um, give me a second, you guys. It's not a wand. It's a flute. Who plays the flute? We don't know? We don't know. Okay, let me give it we a go. check the cheat sheet. How do you play the flute? This is, you don't touch this part, right? <laughs> oh, right is there. Is there a hole? Is there, there a hole? A, there's no hole. I just so put my mouth on that thing. You can't play it because there's no <laughs> hole. Oh my God. He just put his mouth. <laughs> He just put his mouth on. Ooh, I just put my mouth. On. I need to wash my mouth. <laughs> Do I need to wash? Let me wash my mouth. All right, you guys. Sorry for the slight delay. I had to wash my mouth real quick. So this is. It uh, looks like a flute or one. What do you call those things? A recorder. Uh huh. So it looks like a recorder, and it looks like a pretty cool one. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say about it. Pretty cool recorder. Look. And we'll find out where it is from the cheat sheet. That is one, two, three, this is the fourth item in the box. Okay, I might put my dibs on this thing. No. Oh, Alright, fifth item in the box is this empty toilet paper roll. Alright. Toilet paper. And I mean paper towel. Here we go. Toilet paper. I hope it's not a spider. Looks like a Patronus. Oh, wow, this is a nice one. Dibs. Oh, that's The cute. mirror of Aries or Desire. Oh. It's cute and sad at the same time. It's cute, sad, cutesy, sad. It's emo. I like it. No, the the drawing is cute. The drawing is super cute. They already they need to make an animated movie. Let's go put it out. I'll watch it. Right. Yes. That. This has okay. This will be my favorite item. That mirror looks pretty uh, crazy, huh? Looks really good. Nice artwork. All right, we'll put that off to the side. One, two, three, four, five. The sixth item in the box. Oh, cool. Oh wow, that's cute. This uh, this is a pin. This is a Thestral pin. And I, oh, it's Geek Gear, of course. And I absolutely love pins. I do collect pins, so this fits in definitely in the collection. You want to take this? Take it out. Yes, I shall take it out. I don't want to take it out. Why? I like it. The thing, but we'll take it out. So, here's a closer look at it. That has to be, mm, I don't know which one do I like more, the poster or the Thestral pin. Mm. You have to choose. I have to choose. Mine is the sword still. 
and everybody knows what the last item in the box is. That shouldn't. Here we go. Boom! It looks like a book. Right? Take it out. Or a night bus? Oh, it looks like a night bus. I'm going to use my imagination and say, oh, okay, the front. And it's a night bus. The front, you get, it looks like the night bus. So if you collect charms, you got this pretty cool night bus charm. Well, that is all we have for this video. I'd like to thank all of you guys for hanging out with us today. Once again, follow us on Instagram at the Horcrux Hunt. Hit the like button only if you see fit. Subscribe if you like what you're seeing. And comment down below and tell us which one of these items were your favorite. As for me, I really like pins. So I went with this uh, very, very splendid looking Destro pin. Perfectly splendid. And as for my wife, which one did you like? The Sword of Gryffindor. The Sword of Gryffindor, because she is a Gryffindor. Now, tell us which one of these items were your favorite. And as always, from Mr. and Mrs. Horcrux, have a magical one.